Thank you, the chairperson. English was first spoken at the 5th century. It was not spoken by a person. It was spoken by the West Germanic people. Thank you. Thank you, the chairperson. How can it be easy to communicate English in Somali as a national language Well, although our parents doesn't know English? Thank you, sir, because they are going to learn and we are going to learn too. And then we are going to speak together once. Thank you, Mr. Chair Basson. We cannot teach our parents right now English because their brain is already got old, so they cannot learn English in that easy way. And also, as we have spent more than two years to learn English, and we still learn English, so it's not easy to learn English. So how can you see that one? Thank you, sir and chair. We have never even tested yet. We have never even asked. We have never even teach them yet. So how can you say that they can't learn? First practice and then see, because we say practice makes perfect. Thank you, Mr. Chair Basson. I can say that one because we have so many prophets. Even 20 years old people are cannot, cannot learn English. So that's the reason why I'm saying we have already seen teachers. We have asked teachers. We have information about them. So they cannot learn that easy way. Thank you, sir and Chair. Because those prophets you are talking about, they don't have quality teachers like royal Muslim. That's why they can't learn. And everything is possible in the world. Every language we can learn. How can you say, like, even royal... Excuse me. Thank you, the Chair Basson. How can you say, like... Royal Muslim is done. Even uh, Mr. Evans told us that he has been teaching before big people and they were not even accepting what he was telling them. So they were just stuck on what they have learned a long time ago. So they don't, even they don't believe English, what it is. So how can you say it? they can learn from Royal Muslim? Thank you, sir and chair. We cannot just talk about 20 people who failed to learn English. There are 15 million people in Somalia and most of them, by the way, we are now practicing to learn English and it is the easiest language. So we stop making those like nonsense excuses. I would like to ask Honorable Mahmoud, you said if we speak Somali, we're going to be the most successful country in the world, right? Why are we not? We have been speaking Somali for so long. And why we are still, we are still the poorest countries in the world, the, the poorest country in the world. So what is the reason? Tell me. If Somali is making us rich. Thank you very much, the chairperson. Speaking Somali language do not make us to be in the poorest country in the world. But the, the problem is the government. Eh? The problem is the government. They fight against each other. Thank you, the chairperson. I would like to inform Honorable Mahmoud, and he's saying that because it's because of Somalia that, uh, that we are the poorest country in the world. But according to the human in cooperation index, they say that Somalia is the poorest country in the world because of when they started teaching in their local language. Thank you, the chairperson. Thank you, the chairperson. Even UK, they are belong to English. They use their English to teach. But why, why don't we use Somali to teach our children? Thank you, the chairperson. UK uses English, that's true. Because in English is mostly used in the whole world. And if you go to, if you go to any kind of company, you can get a job from in, by, by you knowing English, a talented man with an English. Thank you, chairperson. Thank you, the chairperson. Now we can make Somali companies to use Somali and we can get a job. Thank you, the chairperson. Thank you, chairperson. Can you tell me one company in the whole world that can give you a job with, with a certificate that says you are talented with only Somali and you don't know English? Thank you, chairperson. Thank you, Mr. Chairperson. I would like to defend my colleague saying that if you, even if you don't know English, you can get a job. What is most important is that if you are a quiet person, you, you, cannot, you don't have money to learn English, you may not have all that things, but you may be half in a quality. And people, they don't touch with their language. You may not, we, we have so many people who even can't speak English very well and working for a big companies. I can even name them, but that is it. Thank you, the chairperson. Tell us five companies that can employ you without knowing English and tell us like five jobs you can do without speaking English. Even Somali, they will not accept your own country. Thank you, Mr. Chair Basson. We don't work only for companies. We also work in schools. We have so many teachers even who can't speak English and teaching. Those who teach Arabic, those who teach Trapia, 
And those who even teach mathematics, they are very good at mathematics, but they don't know English. They just use Somali, and they make you to understand, to feel the, the subject, how is going on. So it doesn't matter. School is all the things teach.